Uh, they have built a legal paradigm that presumes records collected about us do not belong to us. The scandal isn't how they're breaking the law. The scandal is that they don't have to break the law. Um, the thing with shutting your phone off that is a risk is how do you know your phone's actually turned off? Um, it used to be uh, when I was in Geneva, for example, uh, working for the CIA. Um, we would all carry like drug dealer phones. Uh, you know, the old smartphones, the, or sorry, old dumb phones, they're not smartphones. Uh, and the reason why was just because they had removable, the battery. removable backs yeah. where you could take the battery out, right? right. And the, the one beautiful thing about technology is if there's no electricity in it, right? If, there, if there's no go juice uh, available to it, if there's no battery connected to it, it's not sending anything because you have to get power from somewhere. You have to have power in order to do work. Um, but now your phones are all sealed, right? You can't take the batteries out. So there are potential ways that you can hack a phone where it appears to be off, but it's not actually off. It's just pretending to be off, whereas in fact, it's still listening in and doing all this stuff. But for the average person, that doesn't apply, right? And I gotta tell you guys, they've been chasing me all over the place. I don't worry about that stuff, right? Um, and it's because if they're applying that level of effort to me, uh, they'll probably get the same information through other routes. Um, I...